Welcome to my channel. I know today is not a day that I normally post a video. Um, I will be posting two videos tomorrow, I promise. I was just hella festive, so I figured I would do a Christmas tag video real quick for ya, since it's almost over. My makeup on. So, firstly, I'm wearing this sweet man overboard Christmas sweater that I got last year. I don't know if they have any Christmas sweaters this year, but if you are a fan, I'll leave you a link to their website below. Buy some of their stuff. They're great. If you don't know who Man Overboard is, go listen to them. So I'm going to be reading the questions from my phone, and here we go. The first one is, what's your favorite holiday movie? I'm going to translate that to Christmas movie, because if we were going with holidays, we would be talking in Halloween. Um, my favorite Christmas movie would be the original cartoon version of How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Not that Jim Carrey crap. I have not watched that, and I refuse to watch that. No. The original. The shit. What's your favorite Christmas color? Um, I guess a combination of the red and green. Per usual, if I had to choose one, it would be red. Do you like to stay in your PJs or dress up for Christmas? I actually prefer to stay in my PJs. I'm somewhat dressed, but that always depends. So if I'm going out doing something, obviously I'm going to dress up. This year I'm staying home because I have to work the day after Christmas. So no going out for Christmas for me. And so staying in my pay jammies. The pee jam? Jammies, that is the plan. For me. If you could buy one present, one person a present this year, who would it be? My sister. Because she's my best friend. So I'm broke right now, but she's gonna get a New Year's gift. <laughs> Do you open your presents Christmas Eve or Christmas morning? We always did Christmas morning. Um, never did previous, never did Christmas Eve gifts, anything like that. My parents were actually here this last week. You will see their videos tomorrow. And so I already have my Christmas gifts, but I'm not going to do my Christmas haul until Monday. So it'll be after Christmas, like regular people. Have you ever built a gingerbread house? I have not. That I know. We used, when we were younger, we used to make Christmas cookies. Like when we, when I was really, really young and we still lived in Ohio near all our family, we used to get everybody around and our friends in the neighborhood and all make Christmas cookies, but I don't think I've ever built a gingerbread house. What do you like to do on your Christmas break? Well, I'm an adult. So we don't really have Christmas breaks as an adult, because you have to work. But I get two days off for Christmas, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day. And I honestly just like to chill out. If my sister is available, me, her, and her boyfriend will normally get Chinese food. It's a tradition. They are actually not going to be around tomorrow. So won't be doing that. But I just like to chill for two days. Apparently film YouTube videos at the last minute. Any Christmas wishes? Money. Um, if you want to get me a Christmas gift, I have an Amazon wish list of stuff I need for my channel. Or I accept gift cards. And I'll include my email down below. Favorite Christmas smell? Probably like pine trees. But not like your actual pine tree that you bring into your house, but like the artificial pine tree. I currently have a, what is it, it's supposed to be peppermint or candy cane scent. Um, like the little melted candles or melted wax. I have that burning right now, but it kind of just smells like somebody brushed their teeth or something. Not that super holiday -ish. Favorite Christmas meal or treat? Um, probably would have used to be deviled eggs, but because I don't eat eggs, it would be mashed potato, basically. Rolls, mashed potatoes, 
That's warm little rolls. Which holiday do you celebrate? I celebrate Christmas. What are you doing for the holidays this year? Mentioned it previously, but my sorry, my cat keeps wiggling stuff. So. My parents were here this last week, so um, I just hung out with them for the holiday, celebrated Christmas with them. Um, so I'm not really doing anything, just hanging out. Gonna be uploading YouTube videos, tweeting, Snapchatting my lazy day. What's your favorite holiday drink? Used to be eggnog. Well, it's weird. So I'm not really that big of a fan of eggnog, but like I would always drink it just because it felt Christmassy, I guess. Um, obviously, I feel a little sad that I'm not drinking eggnog this year. Maybe next year I can do a video on how to make a vegan eggnog. But yeah, I guess eggnog always felt Christmassy. If not that, chocolate milk. Or, sorry, not chocolate milk. Hot chocolate. Candy cane or gingerbread men? I have to say candy cane. I'm not a big fan of gingerbread anything. I think it's a little too intense for me. So candy cane for sure. What's your favorite holiday or Christmas song? Ah, that is such a hard one. I guess... Or I mean, Mr. Grinch. <laughs> but that one doesn't really necessarily count, so I guess, um, Oh Christmas tree, oh Christmas tree, how lovely are your branches. I have a tiny Christmas tree, but I'm not going to pick it up. What's the weirdest gift you've ever received? For a few years, my aunt, rest in peace, used to, on my, my dad's side, my uncle's first wife, used to get me these porcelain dolls. I think I had like four, maybe five of them. I think I still have two or three somewhere. My mom might have them. I don't know. Um, but for a couple years, when I was younger, before she passed away, she used to get me these porcelain dolls. And they were terrifying. Now, the dolls themselves were so beautiful. And I really wish now that I'm older that I would have kept all of them. But at the time, it was terrifying. I think my mom eventually had to tell her to stop buying them for me. Because they just scared the shit out of me. And yeah, so those were pretty scary. But there was one that she got me that... For whatever reason, it was my favorite. I don't know if it was like the last one she got me um, before she passed, but it was this beautiful porcelain doll, and it was the only one that didn't terrify me. And I think my mom still has it. I hope she still has it because I really liked that one. Okay, what's the okay? Have you ever made a snowman? I have. I lived in Idaho for a very long portion of my life. And, sorry, there you go. Kitty, you look very nice, right? I know my foot's getting eaten. Um, have you ever made a snowman? Yeah, so Liz and I hope for a really long time, so we used to make snowmen all the time. Because the snow there is fluffer. And if you're in Idaho and you're watching this, play in the snow for me if you have snow. Because it hasn't snowed here yet. What's your favorite winter fragrance? Kind of the same thing as your favorite Christmas smell. Um, I don't really have a pine trees again. I, what is at the top of your list as Christmas for whichever or whichever holiday you celebrate? I do celebrate Christmas. The top of my list for Christmas is money again because I'm broke. Starving artist over here. What is your most important? What is most important to you about the holidays? Just, it's gonna sound completely cheesy, but getting to spend time with my family. The holidays, when I was younger, we celebrated Christmas, like three different <laughs> Christmases for a very long time. We would celebrate my grandma's birthday, my dad's mom. Her birthday was on the Christmas Eve Eve. Um, also, it was her birthday yesterday. Um, so, she, yeah, it was 
So we would celebrate normally her birthday and then we'd celebrate Christmas Eve with her. We would celebrate, we'd have our own Christmas, Christmas morning, and then we'd celebrate later on Christmas Day with my mom's family. This was when we lived in Ohio and everybody lived near each other at, the, at that time. Um, and so, yeah, we, a lot, of, a lot of holidays, eventually we stopped doing that. One family got Christmas, one got Thanksgiving. And when we moved out of Ohio for the first time, it was the four of us. Um, we moved a lot for my dad's job. Maybe I'll do like a growing up type story and talk about all of that. But my dad traveled a lot for work still, but he would always be home for Christmas. Um, he would, oh, I don't think he ever missed a Christmas that I think about it. Um, so even if he was staying somewhere else where we weren't, always be home for Christmas and it was just great like it just makes me think of family Christmas always does and that's why I love Christmas so spending time with the family that's what's important to me so those are all the questions I will try to leave them below per usual sorry this is a very last minute decision to film this I'm also trying new height and angles I guess and the lighting scrap there is no sunlight out but thank you so much for watching this i hope you enjoy please give it a big old thumbs up subscribe and share if you really are feeling the christmas spirit <laughs> again thanks for watching bye